We're here at South by Southwest, Mount Benel Media. We're meeting interesting people doing very interesting things. And one of those people is this man who I'm just about to introduce you to. I'm Mark Russell. I'm the CEO and founder of Hyper Sciences. And uh, what you have here today, uh, we've got a hypersonic platform technology company. And what we're doing is we're revolutionizing three industries, tunneling, mining, uh, energy drilling, and aerospace. And the way we do that at Mach 5 and above, that means five times the speed of sound, we're able to change the economics of rock breaking industries such as tunneling or drilling. We're under contract with Shell. They're uh, funding our hyper drill program. We're going into field trials here in the summer where we're firing projectiles about this size into the ground right ahead of the drill bit, allowing us to access uh, new energy resources like 10 times faster than ever before. Okay, Mark, that's great. Now, why South by Southwest? Why have you come here with this amazing rocket? <laughs> well, not a rocket, but we're in South by Southwest because uh, we have an office in Austin here. Uh, energy drilling uh, is both in the Houston and the Austin area, so we're really here uh, because of this pull for energy. But South by Southwest itself is just this uh, crossover of uh, imaginative people, uh, technology, industry. You'll, you know, go here. That Elon Musk is visiting, and then uh, you'll find that you know there's something on, um, you know, something uh, in Tibet. I mean, it's just a crossover. And right here, what we've done is crossed over mining with aerospace, and somehow right. created this incredible solution. So, there are kind of people. <laughs> so. Um how did this all happen? I mean, did you wake up one night and say, well, I have to shoot stuff into space and revolutionize the drilling industry, or how did this happen? Yeah, so it, it was a little bit like that. <laughs> um, I'm an aeroastro engineer. I worked as a lead manager and engineer for Jeff Bezos, his Blue Origin company. I led their first vertical takeoff and landing vehicle, and then I also led the crew capsule development. And after years of looking at rocket after rocket and, and trying to predict how they would fail, I realized that we needed a new way to fly. And so I left. My family's all in the mining business, third generation miner. Uh, my brothers and my father ran publicly traded mining companies. So I learned to trade from them after leaving Blue Origin. I was drilling one night. I was literally, it was two in the morning. It was 11,000 feet or uh, you know, over three kilometers down in the hole and I had the aha moment that I could, I had seen a technology called RAM Accelerator from the University of Washington where it was just a tube filled with natural gas and air and you could take a projectile and fly through it and exit at multiple times the speed of sound putting vehicles to the edge of the atmosphere and so you only need a teeny little rocket to get you into space. So that put me down a path of both merging that aerospace with the underground solutions. And, and that, that was, so that was, uh, well, we formed the company in 2014, so it was a little bit earlier than that. Uh, but uh, it's been a few years of technology development, and now we're at a point where we have commercial solutions that are using small projectiles, just like the big projectiles. One's punching into the ground, uh, into the rock, one's punching through the sound barrier on the way out. Now, you work for Boeing and Raymond works for NASA and you know that this type of technology costs a lot of money. How do you manage to raise the funds for this? Yeah, so this is great. It's, a, it's an awesome story. Uh, we use a company, a broker dealer uh, called Seed Invest. And Seed Invest also has partners in the UK called Crowdcube. So you can invest, anyone can invest in this company. So instead of going down the traditional venture capital route where the VC says, you can only do one thing with our money and this is it, you can only drill or you can only do space, we said, look, there's multiple billion dollar markets. In fact, an aggregate, we can affect $100 billion worth of these markets from tunneling to drilling all the way to aerospace. And so Raymond actually has both a NASA background and a financial background from Goldman Sachs. I have this background in aerospace and publicly traded mining companies. So we, we put our brains together worked with uh, Seed Invest, and we were able to raise uh, over $6 million so far, wow. and we're raising like hundreds of thousands of dollars a day while we're sitting here at South by Southwest telling our story. What would you say is the kind of emotional charge? You're talking about firing these rockets yeah. into space. How do you fire up your investors? What's the thing that makes them think, yes, I want to be part of this? Well, I think I think it's twofold, right? It's uh, it's rocket science, and so it really it's, is. It, it really is. <laughs> it's we have a, we have 32 patents and patents pending around it. So there's there's a lot of brain power. Uh, it works, and it works like an engine. Just 
So the ability to um, use a unique business model we call equipment as a service. So as an investor, we're able to fire these projectiles every five seconds. So uh, the big projectiles may be every few minutes. So you're able to create brand new uh, industrial uses for this, and those are multi-billion dollar opportunities. So what gets me going is that we're going to revolutionize uh, energy drilling for deep geothermal, and we could become the biggest energy producer that's completely clean. That gets me out of bed in the morning. The ability, of course, to fly up through the atmosphere without a rocket, and I don't have to worry about anything exploding, this is exciting. So to sum up, Mark, it sounds to me like uh, hyperscience ambition is as far as that rocket thing goes in terms of up. It, <laughs> we think that this is just going to be um, one of the biggest companies in the future. And uh, I've, I've had some experience, and so has Raymond, on how to build companies of huge value. We think that this is the way to do it. Crowd financing is the first step in really bringing this oh, out sure. to the public. Uh, and it's been an exciting ride, and I think it's just going to, seems to be uh, going quite well right wow. now. Yeah. Incredible. And is this uh, the, the, the crowdfunding that you do, is it equity crowdfunding? So all those investors uh, become equity investors in the business? Yeah, that's exactly right. So you're buying stock in the company. Uh, you uh, Actually, our stock is $3.84 per share. Um, in the U.S., it's $1,000 per share. In the U.K., it's like you can buy uh, a little bit less than that per, um, sorry, not per share, but actually the minimum investment requirement. And then you get a certain number of shares, and you get to hear about our updates, and you eventually, as we get uh, more cash flow and get to a point where we can exit, then you make multiples on your money, and that's that's the plan that we wrote. Uh, crowdfunding is an SEC U.S. regulated financing. It is like being a mini public company. You have to follow very stringent rules, and I know exactly what I can say and what I can't say. And everything you heard today is us saying this: this is what we're really doing. We're we're actually building the hardware, and we're going to go make money. And if I'm if I want to invest. Um how much money do I have to put in? I mean, is it only for you know sophisticated investors or can I invest small amounts? What, are the, what does a typical investor put into the business? Well, that, that's a great question. So that's what crowd financing is all about. Um, anyone can invest in this company. You do not have to be a high net individual. You can say, hey, look, I'd love to invest in um, you know Blue Origin, uh, Jeff Bezos' next company, or I'd love to buy into Elon Musk, but you can't. Here you can buy, anyone can buy shares in our company. So the minimum investment in the U.S. is $1,000. Uh, in the U.K., it's, uh, I think, about 20 pounds. So we actually have a lot of U.K. investors, and uh, we're excited to have uh, this kind of reach. Mark, when I first saw this uh, contraption behind me, I was thinking, what is it doing here? What is the purpose? But uh, having spoken to you now, I see how it perfectly fits with South by Southwest. So thank you to you and Raymond for showing us around. How can people find out more about hyperscience? Sure. So uh, just go to seedinvest.com slash hypersciences or uh, come to hypersciences.com. Uh, we have uh, the next uh, few days. So it's uh, March 22nd is when our raise closes. So go to uh, Hyper Sciences and just, you know, learn about us and invest in us. That's great. Thanks very Excellent. much, Mark. Thanks, Thanks so much. much.